Loyalty is loyalty is loyalty, right? Actually, it's not quite that simple. It turns out there are two types of loyalty. There's loyalty to a person and loyalty to an idea. While that may sound like semantic trivia, the difference is really a big deal. It comes down to the difference between a person and an idea. And the difference is between spending years building a six-person company versus building a hundred-plus person company. The idea might be something like living in a democracy or preventing deaths from cancer. Ideas are relatively consistent, at least compared to a person. Unlike ideas, people make mistakes. If you are loyal to a person, you are loyal to their mistakes as well as their good decisions. If you are loyal to the person, how can you question their opinions without questioning the person? Things change so quickly these days, not being able to challenge an opinion can be a huge handicap for your business. By contrast, if your team is loyal to your cause, they can disagree with a specific point without being disloyal. This seemingly small difference can dramatically change discussions and decisions very quickly. Countries like the United States have used this distinction very successfully to last for centuries. We are loyal to the ideals of the country, even when we disagree with the individuals leading the country. Compare this to dictators who demand personal loyalty, but when they leave, the government crumbles. When you create a mission and values for your company, you build a way for your employees to be loyal and still offer creative ideas to grow the company.